Hello, good evening everyone. I am back with new lesson after two days. Uh, so far, we have finished with almost four lessons of MSBT's online MCQ and uh, we have started with unit number two and uh, the last lesson which we covered that was Masiha for the Abundant Seek, which was an article written on Gurmit Singh's uh, social work or philanthropic work. So today I am going forward with this series and the next number is that lesson number 5 uh, e-waste. E-waste means electronic waste. So we will be discussing almost 8 to 10 MCQs on this particular lesson and this is strictly as per the pattern of online examination which has been set by Maharashtra State Board of Technical Education. So for the delay without any uh, you know wasting of time I will start with the PPT and MCQs now. And uh, as I told you that we are going to discuss today that is electronic waste and MCQ as per the pattern of MSBT it's uh, online examination and the subject is English and subject code 22101. So let's begin with the MCQ. What type of MCQ we will get in the examination? We'll try to understand through this PPT. The first question is, what is the meaning of hazardous? So there are four options. Dangerous, excellent, creepy, smooth. And the correct answer is option number A. And that is dangerous. The meaning of the hazardous word is dangerous. So that is the correct answer. Let's move to the next question. That is, what is the meaning of contaminate? What is the meaning of contaminate? So, contaminating means to make something impure or to pollute something, right? So, that is the answer number D is the correct answer here. Contaminate means to pollute something or to make something impure. Let's move to the next question that is BAN, B-A-N, is. So this is a abbreviation of non-basal uh, action network, the organization which work for the e-steward, right? And which type, BAN is what? What is the BAN? So BAN is a e-steward which work for uh, for electronic waste and it's a non-profit organization non-profit organization the answer number c is the correct answer here ban in uh, is a non-profit organization devo devoted to certifying b answer e stewards it is devoted to certify e steward which means to provide license for those uh, shops and uh, those center where we can dispose of properly your electronic waste so this organization provide certificate to such a kind of organization how much of electronic waste is disposed and recycled properly so out of a uh, hundred percent only 13 percent electronic waste is disposed or recycled properly and rest of the 87 percent which creates some or the other kind of pollution so answer number d is the correct answer here let's move to the next question according to wirefly survey how many cell phones go in in the trash every year in the us so wirefly has done a very wonderful survey on the electronic waste and cell phone in the usa and according to their survey 100 million 100 million electronic uh, cell phone cell phone go to trash every year in only USA we are only talking about United States of America and not any other country right now so 100 million million in one country so you can think about the rest of the world so option number C is the correct answer question number seven what is the name of the village where 82 percent tested positive for lead poisoning so in the textbook we have learned that Giu is the village in China where 82% uh, uh, child when they born they test for lead poisoning and uh, almost uh, 7 out of 10 have some or the other kind of disease and this, this is due to electronic waste. So option number C is correct here. 
the question number eight which organization provides certification for recycler so which organization provides certificate for the recycler in the lesson we have learned that there is a ban basil action network this organization provide certificate to the recycler center and uh, the certificate which has been provided by this organization to any of the center consider as a authentic center for recycling your e-waste so answer number b is correct here question number nine what is the authentic retail option available for recycling e-waste so now that was the uh, certified by international organization basil action network that is one option and second there are some private retailer who can recycle your uh, e-waste but what is the authenticity of that recycler that is a question and therefore best buy is one of the private retailer who can recycle your e-waste properly without being a dumping uh, e-waste of any part of the world or it cannot create any kind of cyber threat to you so best buy is the private option that is one thank you and best of luck for the exam so i will be making more videos on the remaining lessons of the uh, unit number two and after that i'll be trying to focus on the unit number three that is paragraph writing and dialogue writing and after that vocabulary building and finally i will be making some videos on speech writing also so this is my schedule i will cover all these within four or five days or it may be possible before 15th of january because i know that on 25th of january you are going to face this examination so i am just instrumental to help you out regarding this upcoming examination of english subject subject code 22101 thank you so much for watching my video i request you if you are a student of diploma first year then please share this video among all your friends and let them benefit by this uh, lecture series which we are making for uh, making this video video series for all the diploma holders who can uh, you know confidently face the upcoming exams of at least english subject thank you so much thanks a lot thanks a lot